normal period is two to seven days. Correct. Correct. Mm -hmm. Now, you said what, what constitutes an abnormal period in terms of length? So in terms of length, we start worrying about when they're more than a week mm -hmm. just because of the blood loss, right? So we don't want the girls to get to a point where they start bec becoming anemic and symptomatic, where they're too right. weak to go to school or they're having palpitations or chest pain and all that stuff. Um, so at the beginning, it's normal that girls will have periods for like 14, 15 days. Wow. Um, yeah. And then it should regulate in the first five years. Okay. Um, so that's when we'll be able to see. Mm -hmm. now, what about when it comes to fibroids or uterine cancer? Is that something that you look for as well when the period is a little longer than, than expected? Not necessarily in teen girls, okay. uh, but yes, in the 40-year-olds, uh, people who are starting to go through menopause. So women who, when they start going through that process, that change of life, they start getting longer periods or they skip periods right. or they have intermenstrual bleeding. So that's important for us to know because it can lead to us um, trying to look into it and seeing if there's any pro probability that it could be cancer or anything like Absolutely. that. Absolutely.